All right, we're gonna take a little ride here in a 1964 Ford Falcon Futura. Uh, not quite a Mustang, but not the same money either. It's a nice driving little car. It's a little bit of a hot rod. It, it's got a 302 V8 in it uh, with some uh, Doug's headers, dual exhaust, Flowmasters. It's got a three and a quarter uh, differential ratio and uh, just a nice little driver. It's got bucket seats with a console. It's uh, Wimbledon white is the original color with black interior. Little old school AM FM Sony cassette player there. You know, it's got dual reservoir disc brakes in it and no power steering. Uh, but you know what? It drives good. It's not hard to drive at all. It's got a nice set of 14-inch um, rally wheels on there. The early Magnum style. The radial tires. A little bit of a project. It needs a headliner. It needs a couple things here and there. The paint's not the best. But you know what? For the money, it's a nice little car. A little starter project. You can drive and use. Uh, aluminum radiator. Seems to, seems to run really good. Dash is in nice shape. The seats are in good shape. Actually, most of the headliner is good. It just needs like the sail panels back there. Might be able to clean that up a little bit. But the chrome is nice. Trim is nice. Pretty cool. Well, we'll go up here and we'll take some more pictures and video for you. All right, here's our little 64 Falcon Futura. Little two-door hardtop. Pretty cool. Put all the windows down. Got no post. This was originally a V8 car, 260 V8. Now it has a, a 302 with headers on it and uh, aluminum radiator and disc brakes. Just a good driving little car. It's finished in Wimbledon white. That's the factory color. Um, the paint, eh, it's okay. You know, it looks pretty good in pictures and video. It's uh, just an old paint job. You know, a little bit of clear coat here and there. Uh, that, that, but we polish it up. It looks pretty good. It's a nice looking driver. The chrome's in good shape. It's got nice tires. Wheels are in good shape. A little 14 inch Magnum style wheels. All the stainless is straight. Good looking little car. I like these because they're not too big. It's kind of like a 64 or 65 Chevelle. These years were good, uh, I guess you'd call them like mid sized cars, but they make really neat muscle cars. Put a little bit more power to them, put bigger wheels and tires on them. You could add a uh, Fuel injection, air conditioning, I mean, it's its endless on what you could do to fix them up. I'll show you the interior. It's also nice that this one has buckets and console. It's not a bench seat. Seats are in great shape. Dash is in nice shape. Original uh, gauges there. It's got an AM, FM uh, cassette player. That dates it a little bit, doesn't it? But the back seat's nice. It can use a headliner. It's got a little, I think I have one in a box that comes with it. We probably won't get to that, but you know, I try to keep the price down on this one. Door panels are decent. Not a bad little car. Fun little toy for not a bunch of money. Here's the power plant and the little Falcon Futura. Nice little 302, you know, still got a two barrel carburetor on it. It's a pretty basic little motor, you know, like I said, it's got a dual reservoir disc brake setup, so it stops good. Automatic transmission. It's got a three and a quarter inch, uh, or three quarter ratio rear differential. Fire this one up for you. Nice running little car. Oh, there's the door tag, by the way. Just tells you what it had when it was new and ratios, transmission, color. It's kind of neat about Fords. It's in the door there, door jam. But it's a nice, smooth running little motor. Runs cool with that aluminum radiator. The dual, exa dual exhaust with Flowmasters going all the way out the back. Pretty cool. Well, if you want to check this one out in person, come out to see us. We're at 2158 Union Place in the city of Simi Valley, California. Phone number is 818-591-1313. Uh, my name is Rich. I'd be happy to help you, show you around the, the shop, and show you this car. All right, thanks for watching.